Okay, so Shin takes game one. All right, so Shin it decided that he's going to try and go Fox to deal with Kelly. Didn't even try to go Fox to deal with me, but it's whatever. I, I, I wasn't feeling the game today, but whenever I play Shin, I feel the game, so. Huh? You ain't fighting no one. You're winners finals. You have to wait. You have to wait until everybody else catch up to you. And, uh, All right, so um, so we got we got Shen using Fox. Kel played him really good in winners. I think it was winners round. No, it wasn't winners round two. It was winners semis, right? And Kel beat him two of them. And Kel was kind of playing on point. Ah, uh, yeah, Shen messed up. So I don't know. Shen feels like he's been playing off today, but. Uh, I think he's still playing good. It's just that you know, uh, Kel wasn't really around much. So if you if Peach is a character, that if if you're not used to fighting her, she's going to give you problems, obviously. So uh, Shin probably is a little bit more warmed up now. Probably knows what he needs to do. Almost lost the first game, but I still think um, Kel is carrying the majority of the momentum. Right after this is finished, we're going to put Smash Four on on uh, recording setup. Going to do winners. Finals versus finals, grand finals. I am joined here and helped by. Yep, I am joined here and helped by uh, biscuits. Probably taking a break from Smash. I, I I wanted to take a break today, but then you know everybody say, hey, contribute to the pot, so I did, and I contributed to the pot. Yeah, you gotta help the community as much as possible. I mean, and that's the whole reason I do this. Oh, right where you see um, these two, LGT playing? That's free. So if he needs to fight somebody, he can fight Holy Warrior on the same team. Elrich. Elrich, you up, boy. Smash 4. TV 2. Now, hey, that TV at the end right there where Kai is. Right where Jimmy is. Right where Jimmy is? Yeah, kick Jimmy them off that way. All right, so... Um, Okay, Xenon lost the cooler. It's crazy. Okay, let's get back to Smash. Melee. Who won? Okay, yeah. Shonen Kel won game two. I don't know. Um, so, people probably wondering my mood, I guess. Why I don't on a blame melee. That's quite fairly simple. I, I just be around Smash all the time. Mondays, Thursdays, and then I gotta do the bi-weeklies. I kinda just need a break from it. Because, you know, bezel is a business and yeah, this is more of a business for me than actual casual play. And I just, sometimes it just sucks the fun out of gaming. So I, I just need a break. Once I recuperate from my break, I'll be back. But let's get back to what really matters. This is Kel versus uh, Shin. So Shen looks like he kind of figured out what Kel is doing. He did go to Pokemon Stadium, which is a good counter pick for Fox. I do feel Fox kind of wins in this matchup on the stage just because it is the room and the small ceiling. He could run away in camp, which he's doing right now. And um, Kel is behind in stock, so he, he can't really take the trade. He is kind of like zoning in and out to try and, you know, make Shen at least uncomfortable shooting the double lasers. But uh, Shin is trying to extend his lead, which he's doing a pretty good job of. Every time when um, you see Kel closes in to try and cover the space from him using the double lasers, he would kind of throw it in there. And, you know, just to cover that space, like, okay, you're going to try and cover the space right here. Let me get there before you. Um, and he isn't playing nervous. I still think his hands a little... It, it, I still think it's a little shaky on his part. But, um... Back here? Grab ledge? Oh... Is it? Oh, 
Oh, now. Oh, why? Oh my God! So Shonen Kel was behind, and he's now bringing it back. Okay, good. He knew that Shin was going to go for the jabs, and he was ready with a shield grab. Kind of going for the desperate down smashes. Doesn't really need to right, right, right now. Oh, Shin. Shin kind of being smart right there. Went for the shine off the ledge because he thought Kel was going to go for the ledge. Kel ended up dying up, and then he caught him with an up tilt. So this stage position is in Fox's favor, but he'll have to get the lasers for it in order for it to work. Kel damage output still. Oh, yeah. So he's trying to rush in after he did the down smash, wasn't able to get. Oh, yep. Ah. Uh, that was crazy. He, he got the shine when he needed it. Kel was bringing that back. The momentum was definitely in his favor, but he let Shin push him off the ledge, and that's what take away from him. Surprised he didn't go to Dreamland, went to Battlefield. And he, I, I, I don't know if he took Yes, he did take him to FOD already. Uh, I think Yoshi's story might have been a good stage too, but this is a neutral. I think Fox is kind of more silly on the stage, depending on playstyle. Nice. And he's going to grab ledge, and that's the stock. So Kel leading off pretty good, uh, pretty decent with the first stock. Uh, when you're able to take that first stock, and you kind of you set yourself in a comfortable position, like, okay, I have the stock lead, I just need to extend. Um, but Fox is such a comeback character, you know. See, he, he got the dash attack to an up smash, and if he could even up the stock, if Shin does even up the stock without Kel, you know, adding any percent, then Keller lose the momentum that he has. And now he's just lost the momentum. Oh, nice shine up smash. Okay, so Oh, nice shine up smash. Okay, he's able to get the net up smash. And let's see where we're going to go from here. So Shin kind of extending his lead. Like I said, I don't really like. I, I don't feel like this was a good stage for Shonen Kel, simply due to the fact that um, Fox just has too much room to run around. If I was him, I would have just probably taken him to Dreamland if anything. Even though that would have given Fox more space, it would have increased his survivability. Okay, so we're going to set two.